Yo, 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 hello guys and welcome to part 3 from the Sun and Moon uh, event island. Uh, let's get the Aztec Emperor Dragon for 10 gems and see what we have to do for the Firewolf Dragon. Alright, again we have to collect gold, feed some dragons and complete 4 combat quests. And also we have to hatch some hybrid eggs. Let's do today the battle quest. Let's see, let's use my legacy dragon. Alright, the first dragon will be the sunset dragon, which is a flame dragon. And you can critical hit this dragon with uh, sea and electric attacks. And the sunset dragon, it is immune to light attacks. So do not attack it with light. All right, let's see the second dragon, uh, second combat. Let's use the apocalypse. All right, second dragon, the Keiju dragon. Uh, we can critical hit this dragon with metal and war attacks. And the Kaiju dragon, it is immune to electric attacks. So take care. Let's do black hole once more. And Okay, now let's see the third dragon, third combat. Let's use uh, Apocalypse Dragon again. Next up, the Ivory Dragon. This is a Terra Element Dragon, so we can critical hit it with Metal and War attacks. And the Ivory Dragon, it is immune to electric attacks. So do not attack him with electric. All right. And the last combat, the last dragon will be the blue alien dragon. We cannot critical hit this dragon, so I recommend you guys to use your legacy dragon or something. Or any other legendary dragon with legend spell attack, because the legend spell it is very powerful. Alright. And that's about it for the combat quest uh, in the Sun and Moon. Alright, 405 gems for the Firewolf Dragon. We will get it very soon, so yeah. Check out the next episode, maybe I will get more gold and feed dragons and hatch some eggs in order to buy this dragon for less gems. Until next time, have an awesome day guys and have fun in Dragon City, yo!